Welcome Virgo, this is your weekly Terrascope reading for uh, for July 28th to August the 3rd, 2014. So I did try to work through my day as fast as possible, hoping I would hit some sunlight, but I missed the mark uh, definitely on this one. So I do apologize that we're inside today, but I do want to thank you as well for your blessings and your support. Um, without you, there would be no me, um, so I truly truly appreciate each and every one of you in my life so thank you I do love you but let's get to your reading because you know we start off with our first card of being judgment so it's it's looking at the big picture You have been going through this redefining of yourself, okay? Because we have the standing in your truth and standing in your light. And really, success is coming because of that effort that you've made. And it's time to uh, move away from things. Um, things that are bringing you the wrong energy in your life. And it's time to not only shut those doors behind you, but to slam them closed. Make sure that they can't open again um, so that you can go forward. It's a very beautiful path that you're going forward into as well. So it's just a beautiful reading, really. Um, so I think it's going to be a very um, good week for you, but it's going to be a very enlightening week for you. Um, looking at the bigger picture, how you shine, judgment coming in, and um, evening up playing field for you giving you um, what you rightly deserve. Giving you the path to go forward in that light, in that beauty, in that wisdom, in that courage that you have definitely acquired. Uh, the Knight of Pentacles with strength. So your strength is going to come from making that firm action plan going forward. Knowing what you need to take, knowing that what you carry with you on your path um, actually is your well-being, is your beauty, um, is what you deserve. And please, um, you truly need to understand how much you actually deserve what the universe, what God has in store for you in order for you to reap the full benefits of it. The Knight of Pentacles and Strength. Uh, you've acquired the strength. You've acquired the courage. Um, spirit is right behind you in prayer for your well-being. And the Knight of Pentacles is... Well, he's the guy who knows exactly what he needs in life in order to make him happy. And almost protecting it. Holding it close to him on his journey. He doesn't put it in the sack where it would probably be just as safe. It's got to be in his hands where he can see it at all times, where he can keep his eye on it. He knows it's safe. And making the plan to keep it safe going forward. And admiring the beauty of it as well. Um, to put it in one of his saddlebags would be not being able to admire exactly what he's worked so hard to carry forward with him on his path. <coughs> Excuse me. The more you stand your ground this week, the more you will see successes come to you. And the successes um, have to do with people, community, um, organizations that you belong to, like-minded people, whether or not it's um, globally for you or a small circle of friends in your community. Um, it could be in the workplace. But definitely um, standing up for who you are, drawing that line, saying, um, you know, the buck stops here. This is as far as it goes before I challenge you. And you have that look of determination in your eyes. Um, and really standing in your truth, really standing in your beauty, standing in your light, knowing what you what you want going forward and demanding it of the universe demanding it 
not asking, please can I have, please could you help me. Thank you for um, allowing this on my path today. Thank you for the successes I'm about to um, go through today. The victories I have today. Thank you for the victories I'm about to have today. You know, positive affirmations as you step forward, believe in yourself, believe in your worth, believe in your beauty. And if there's something that's throwing you off balance, you need to slam the door on it and not allow it anymore. There's no more time for that. The Six of Swords and the Five of Pentacles. Now, um, if it were a personal reading, I would have to say there's travel in the cards for you. But when it is a general reading like this, I would have to say for the majority of you, although there are some of you that will be traveling, the majority of you, it's a traveling of who you are. It's a traveling of moving one step farther down your path. Now, your path is... Um, you have your protection. You have your lessons. Okay? And look at how that water is illuminated there for you. I bet you if you were truly one of the people in, the, in this picture, you would need sunglasses in order to even look in that direction. They both look away for good reason. It's... It's so bright. The future is so bright. Where you're going is so beautiful and so wonderful um, that you can't even look at it with the naked eye. It's just too bright. It's too beautiful. Now, this card is um, very much a portal that you're going through. It does have the pentacles on the door, so this means there is money, well-being, um, just beauty behind this door for you, okay? It's got the pentacles around the, the, the door frame. So it's very much a path of well-being. It's very much a path of um, career, financial stability, um, everything kind of under that umbrella. Okay, but this is you, and you need to stand up, and you need to stand tall, and you need to walk forward with a sureness in your step. It's your action that's going to make it happen. And yeah, the door does look a little drab. Most people wouldn't pick that door. And we're not really being shown what's behind that door. We're not given any real hint except for the pentacles. Telling us this is a door of well-being. Telling us this is a door of financial security. Prosperity. And then we have the four of pentacles and the eight of wands. And the four of pentacles says, you know what? You, you've done the work. You have the talent inside you to go wherever you want to go. So define where you want to go and then reach over and pick up those talents, pick up those unique gifts, turn around and walk through. There's the gate with the pentacle on it. So everything is showing you that there is definitely a doorway, a pathway to go upon that is going to bring you um, a sense of stability. It's going to bring you financial gain. It's going to bring you um, a job promotion or a boost in your career, um, a new job, um, total well-being. Okay, so if your health has been suffering, it could be um, some very good news coming through for your health right now or a new action plan in order to um, make sure that you're living a healthy, wonderful life. It's time to wait, make way for new experiences, new happiness, new growth. Okay, so um, there's no more time really for you to just sit on the fence and saying, I'm not really what to, sure what to do about the situation or this person or this action. Um, it's, it's now time to look inside, realize that you have all the gifts that you need in order to go forward, making a very strong stance on it, a very determined stance on it believing in yourself and believing in God, the universe, your angels and spirit guides, that you're all on the same team and it's for your greater well-being. Because when your light is shining brightly, um, everybody else around you gets a piece of that light too. And therefore their light shines brightly too. So, until we meet again, please remember, I do love you.